Everybody stand on by. I'll be right here in a second. A lot of you have already seen my video today, but uh, stand by. Got a, a live I'll do with you. Hi, hello, hello. Hey everybody, it is Sunday, and uh, typically I do my sunrise Sundays today, and uh, I did one earlier. Uh, I've already shared a video here on LinkedIn today, and as well on, as on Facebook, and I wanted to uh, just come and do uh, one more uh, effort here to do a live, in hopes that some of you that are uh, seeing it pop up on your notifications, your feed, that you might uh, stop in for a second and see what uh, this is about. So. Uh, I posted a video today. Um, I was going to share it here, but I'll, I'll spare you that time because it's going to be, it's a four minute video. So please go to my profile page here at LinkedIn and, um, and watch the video that I posted this morning, uh, just within the past hour or so. And that will explain to you a lot of what I'm getting ready to say. Uh, for, for many of you, you don't, uh, many of you do know, many you don't, um, that I have a nonprofit organization. Uh, which is an outreach that we do uh, for folks around the world. And uh, one of the things that uh, are, is under my care are a couple of orphanages in Africa that uh, I oversee. And, uh, and we're always struggling with needs there because it's just a high, high need scenario. Uh, and sometimes are worse than others. Right now is not a good time. Uh, the emergency need I have right now is not coronavirus. It is that the director of our uh, our, our affiliation in Nairobi, uh, his wife, uh, her name's Edna, she's 28 years old, was and died Friday. Um, she is, uh, the doctor said that she was overworked, overstressed, and she bled to death through, uh, from what we could tell was a bleeding ulcer. By the time she got to the hospital, it was too late. So um, needless to say, um, we have expenses, which are uh, the hospital bill, the morgue bill, the casket cost, and delivery of the body from the hospital to the morgue, to the funeral home thing, to the, to the uh, site where she'll be buried. And it has to be done within 48 hours, which means we only have a few hours left today, which will be Monday soon there, uh, before the 24-hour, 48-hour period is over because of this coronavirus that's happening everywhere. Uh, that area in Nairobi has uh, has mandated that if somebody dies, they have to be buried within 48 hours. I don't get it, but that's just as what it is, and that's what we have to deal with. And uh, that's why I'm trying to urgently raise this extra cash. All right, so with the, what cash? I need 800 bucks minimum. $800 is going to cover the cost of all the things I just mentioned, uh, but does not include the cost of the kids. So. Uh, this is the director and his wife, and the, his wife, Isaac, his wife, Edna, who passed away. You know, it's his right-hand gal, it's his wife, his partner, his, his friend, his soulmate, and, and she does a lot of the work there. And they have two kids, three and five-year-old, and now they don't have a mom. It's horrible. And I know there's bad stuff happening all over the world. I'm, I'm just one scenario. But it's a real one and need real help. And on top of that, we've got the kids that are in the uh, orphanages. So I've got two that are under my care, one in Kisi, Kenya, Africa, and the other that's in Nairobi. And uh, I love them all very much. And uh, it just breaks my heart to, to be kind of at a, at a loss right now to be able to do things, but we can't help uh, with, with this, what I'm going to talk about. So the kids now, they haven't eaten in about two weeks, uh, specifically in Kisi, I know that's a fact. And they're having a hard time as well in, uh, in Nairobi, especially with the, the passing of Edna. So uh, we need money for that too. And then now because of Corona and all the things that are going on, they have lockdowns and they have, just like here in the States where, where towns are being shut down, you're not allowed to go out and do shopping and go around you know, social events and things of that nature there either. And some of the costs have risen for their foods. Um, we need food. I mean, I, I can get by with getting them rice and and uh, some. Uh, they have like a meal, like a porridge kind of a thing, which is a last resort, but it's better than nothing. Uh, and some vegetables and whatnot, but that's not as easy to come by um, as some of the other stuff that might be uh, readily available. More like the rice, which provides some nutrients, but you know, it is what it is. We got to do something. So 
anything over the $800 that we raise um, today. And by the way, this is not like, I don't need you to pray about this and think about what's going to happen. I'm like today, what can you do right now when you donate? Because this is like a now moment, right? And there's a lot going on. I know. I'm so sorry. I, I hate to bring, bring this out at this moment, but this is a need that, that's on my plate and I'm asking uh, my network and community to help out. Uh, there, I've got thousands and thousands of people that follow me and listen to me and I offer I offer wisdom, advice, knowledge. Uh, I give things away every single day here at LinkedIn. I'm not doing that for a pat in the back. I do it because I love you. However, I throw a lot out there for y'all. I'm just asking for a little help here today on this. And it probably won't be the last time I ask. But I'll, I'll be serious. However, I have a need today, and that need is Edna. It's not about me. It's not about a car. It's not about gas. It's not about, you know, double comic club. It's not about any of that junk. It's about a 28-year woman who just died and a husband who is frantically figuring a way to make it all happen. And I wanna make sure that we can help them get through with this, all right? And, and these kids over 50 that I have in my care um, need to eat. And um, you know, most of us watching this today um, probably didn't miss a meal. And these kids, they have like 14 days worth of meals. They're starving, they need food. and. Uh, your help would be greatly here's the deal when you give the money through my donation link here in a second your money will go there today and it will be used today and you will make a difference today in the world in africa specifically all right so please consider that thank you so much for that i hate to, to i'm not trying to twist your arms you know i just being real i'm not afraid to ask and i'm asking and uh, every dollar helps so you know if you think oh I hope somebody else does that for Matt. No, 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 you. That's you. That's like, you know, what would you have spent at Starbucks today? What would you have done at the grocery store today? I mean, whatever. I mean, there's there's ways you can help out. Every amount helps. 5, 10, 20, 100, 200, 500, 1,000, whatever you can send. Um, and if it's uh, you're in the States and you are doing it because you want a tax write-off, no problem. You can have it. I'm a 501c3. If you don't care about that, then just give to give. Uh, you don't have to get a tax write-off to give, right? So uh, many of us on this platform are, are more than able to do that, and I'm asking for that support today. All right, so you can do that by going to my website. You can go to uh, mattcrump.tv, and on the upper right-hand corner of the, of the website, you'll see uh, a link that says Donate, and it'll go to my donation page there. And then you can go to our ministry movement site, which is godsgotthis.love. It's uh, God's Got This, all one word, G-O-D-S-G-O-T-T-H-I-S, God's Got This, dot love, not dot com, dot love. And, um, and make the donation there as well. Same link, same stuff, but it's just um, two different sites. All right, so mattcrump.tv, which might be even faster, easier for you to remember. Uh, if you can go there, I'm trying to see if I got something here I can pull up on my, on my uh, app here. If I get any addresses, I probably should have done that ahead of time, huh? <laughs> All right, I don't see that, what I'm looking for. Um, now, in the video, I've got some pictures of, uh, I wonder if I can do this while I'm live. Let's see what happens here, hang on. I'm gonna choose a photo, photo library, let me see. Oh man, maybe this will work, here we go. All right, let's see now. Did that work? Oh, it did. All right, folks, there you go. That's Edna. She's 28 years old, was 28. And um, she's the one who, who just passed away. Um, she's a beautiful young gal. She loved God. She loved her husband. She loved the kids. She had two children of her own with her husband Isaac, three and five years old. And uh, now, now gone. What's really crazy is, and, and horrible is, um, I think about uh, two years ago, Isaac's uh, daughter at that time, she was six, another daughter, was walking home from school, um, on you know, out in the rural area of, uh, of of Nairobi, and going through a field and was bit by a snake, and uh, and was and was killed. It was a poisonous snake, and didn't get home in time, and passed away. So this family has been through mess, and they continue time after time to serve their community, their neighborhood, their people and try to bring life and hope and freedom and food and and love to people that don't have it. Uh, and for many of you that know about Africa, there are so many orphans around there. There's no shortage of orphanage, orphans, unfortunately, um, but there are shortages of, of good quality 
real orphanages that aren't there just to, uh, you know, take money from from other people and have selfish gain. Um, I stand for these organizations that I'm a part of because they are a part of a vetting process with me and are part of a, a relationship that goes into at least a year um, as I help them to learn how to do the business side of things and and uh, discipling and things of that nature. So, you know, I stand up for and, and vouch for these organizations, but you're giving through mine, Matt Crump Ministries. All right, enough there. So please go to mattcrump.tv, mattcrump.tv or godsgotthis.love now and make a donation, right? So it's mattcrump.tv or godsgotthis.love. Go there right now, make a donation. And uh, I would greatly, greatly appreciate it because that money will be collected today and I will be sending it off so we can get, uh, get this taken care of for, for her needs to be buried and for our kids to get some food. And I greatly, greatly appreciate your help. All right, folks, uh, I don't wanna take any more of your time. Go to my profile and you can watch the complete video and, uh, and see what some of those details are I had in there. Very similar to what I shared here. But again, mattcrump.tv, God's got this dot love. And uh, I will see you all again very, very soon. I love you all, appreciate so much for your help and your support. Thanks for taking time to watch this. Please share if you watched and let somebody else know about it too. Probably better to share the, the other video that's already up, that's not alive. Uh, either one, I don't care. Whatever way you can do it. Appreciate it. God bless you. Give me to Edna today. Matt Crump TV.